Hey guys, I just want to talk to you guys about the Hunger Games. The Hunger Games. The Hunger Games. Yes, the Hunger Games. Uh, I'm actually a really die-hard fan of the movie. I I I enjoyed the book. I read the first one twice. My class is now reading the second one, and my class is taking a uh, field trip to go see the movie. Uh, some of the actors in the movie include Katniss Everdeen, played by Jennifer Lawrence. Pizza Malark played by Joshua Hutchins. And Gail played by some other person I do not know. I actually am one of the biggest fans of uh, The Hunger Games. Uh, there's this test on Facebook called Capital.pn and it shows you what district you're going to be in, what your district number is, and what you do. And uh, part of District 12, you also get a job, and uh, I became a blaster. I don't know what that is. But on my other Facebook, which if I want you to know it, I'll most likely put it down here. Um, uh, I got District 7, which is the furniture people district. And I got furniture people. One of the things about the Hunger Games is uh, what's it really about is this. Well, I don't want to spread out too much, but you read the books. Awesome for you. Uh, one of the things in the Hunger Games is, well, if you don't, this is a the part of the video. Uh, if, uh, if you've read the books, uh, you, might, you can still watch. If you, uh, haven't read the books and you want a spoil alert, just keep watching. Uh, one of the things in the Hunger the thing about the Hunger Games is, uh, uh, in the Hunger Games, there's a woman named, a teenager named Katniss Everdeen, and her little sister, Primrose Everdeen, and they're both named after plants. Now, the mom, it doesn't give a description of what she really is. Uh, what happened is, third part of District 12, and, uh, uh, their district is coal mining, so, uh, her, their men usually worked, it was only men that could work in the coal mines, and then one day when, uh, Katniss was younger, way before, well, I guess when Primrose was a, a baby, her father died, and the mother became really, uh, depressed, so, two years later, uh, starting the book, uh, She's just working. She goes out in the woods with her best friend Gail, and uh, they Ill Ill illegally hunt. Uh, sorry, no stuff in that uh, <laughs> you guys just hurt me. Um, they illegally hunt for pelts to get money so they can feed the families, and they go to this black mar uh, market, black market. Where they have their friend uh, Lucy Sale. Sale, uh, I forget, I haven't read the book at all. And uh, they basically do that. And there's this bread maker uh, named uh, Pizza Malark, who later becomes uh, Katniss's uh, partner in the games. Uh, they have they have a little bit of history. And so there's this day called the Reaping Day. And. Uh, Uh, they choose one boy and one girl from each district, district 1 through 12. There, it was usually, it was districts 1 through 13, but district 13 caused an uproaring and they were, they all died. Like, the whole government of them was like, killed them. Like, they're all dead now. There's no such thing as district 13 anymore. Anyways, uh, they choose one boy and one girl from, uh, each, uh, district to play these, in these hunting games. For about for starting the uprising, because they make sure it never happens again. Uh, so <laughs> they all have to. So all ki kids from ages 12 to 18 have to fight to the death for the government's amusement. If you see my brother's face, he's like, "Oh my gosh, what? That's so weird. Why would they do that?" Uh, so, and you can put your name in as many times as you need to to get, because District 12 is a very poor district. Uh, uh, Gail put his in like 62 times, I think, and Katniss put hers in, I forget how many times, like 40 something, and, uh, just so they can get stuff to, uh, supplies, uh, called, uh, it's like, I want to say some grease, but Tesla's, that, uh, helps their family get through the year, and so they get their name, 
so uh, uh, they get uh, names pulled out each. So ages age through 12 through 18, if you're chosen, uh, you fight to the death of other districts after you train. So. <coughs> Uh, why the, uh, what's her name? I forget her name. The woman there pulls out the name of mm -hmm. Prim. Prim is 12, is 12 year old baby sister of Katniss. Katniss doesn't seem to like that, so she, uh, you can be a tribute saying you want to, you would go in for that person to fight to the death. Uh, so that all happens, and then I'm only going to say a few more because my brother seems to be getting annoyed. <coughs> <coughs> hate this. Um. Then this guy Pizza Malark, played by Joshua Hutchinson or Hutchins, whatever. Uh, he's he's my favorite. He's my favorite actor. Now Jennifer Lawrence is now my favorite actress. It was a uh, um, Selena Gomez, but you know the better, it's a awesome actress come next. Uh. So now they're off with their, what do they call them, uh, I want to say counselor, but it's the person uh, that helps them get prepared for the Hunger Games, which is Haymitch, who came from District 12. He was only, he's pretty much the only one in their district to win uh, uh, the Hunger Games out of 24 tributes, which is usually how many tributes are in, uh, in their the games. But with his year, they doubled it to 42, and he's, he beat them all. So now he, he helps them survive, while Katniss has their, their stylists that help her get to this. There's this one black guy. Oh, that sounds racist. There's this one guy. Uh, I, I, I keep forgetting people's names. I haven't read the book. It's spring break, so. Uh, they're helping them prepare to show who you are. And uh, Katniss is stylist. Uh, show is just like is she, he's telling her how to prepare for all this. Don't be afraid. Get preparing them for the interviews. And uh, Peta's, which is Portia. I don't, I don't know why I can remember her name. Uh, her Portia, which helps him. She helps him not, not that much though. I, I don't see any help there. And so. Uh, I'm just gonna stop at where the before the game start. Uh, <coughs> so they're all training in this training room, and uh, there's there is a 12 year old in the game who's called Rue. Now she's a little girl, and I think she came from the, sh the Disney Channel show uh, Jesse. I'm not sure. I haven't the I, I can't remember if come on in a while. Uh, so she's in there, and then it's the it, it's the day of the interviews. I know I'm like jumping across and everything. It's the day of the interviews to uh, what they're doing. Uh, so they have to go through districts one through tw uh, eleven, because district twelve they have to be last. They uh, come out uh, pizzas first, and basically he confesses his love with Katniss. And uh, she ain't really that happy about that. And Katniss comes out. It's her turn to the interview. And uh, I forget the dude's name. Like, we just watched it but um, on ETV. But we just watched it and... Uh, no, not that. Don't hurt yourself. Uh, in the interview, Katniss is uh, uh, just like talking about how she promised to win the games for Prim. That she's going to come home safe. And then, so now it's there. It's the day of the last part I'm telling you. Uh, it's the day of the numbers you get, Jared Cameron. Uh, it's the day of they get their points. So, uh, uh they have to get their numbers. Best score means they're the best. So. Of course, districts one through eleven go first, uh, and I guess Peta is now going in. They're wishing each other luck, and it doesn't really tell much of Peta or what he's doing. But um, it's Katniss's turn, and the 
apparent, the way they tell it in the book, I forget her name, the person that wrote it. By the way, thank you for writing the book. It's like the best book ever. What are you doing? Can you just make sure the camera's pointing on me? Um, it's been a long day. They're out. They're out having a pig roast, and she's uh. Of course, she makes the point uh where they need to start paying attention to her. They're more worried about their meal than about a girl that's about to risk her life just to entertain them. Uh, so she gets pissed off about that and shoots an arrow at the apple, scaring the crap out of the uh, judges, which which you would think should they give her a low grade for that, a low point for that, but they gave her 11. So everyone's like, whoa, what? No way, no way. And I guess Ruth Ruth scored a 10 or 9 or 10. I don't know what she has. Vita got like an 8 or a 7. And then it's they have their last meals of the day, and uh, they're about to go uh, about to start the games. Uh, right uh, it, it, I, in the commercial in the book, it doesn't really describe what Peter's doing. Probably just chilling with Porsche while Porsche's helping him out. Um, how long have we been recording? Oh my gosh, whenever anyone's gonna watch this. Um I post on Facebook just so people know. <laughs> um uh Katniss's uh stylist is sitting there uh talking to Katniss saying it's gonna be okay, just keep control and uh uh what's it whatever his name is gives her this pen. Now they also did DNA changing so it's called they have the Mockingbird and the Blue Jay together, so it's called the Mockingjay, and it gives her the pen. Now, usually they're not allowed to do that because of, uh, one time, uh, a uh, tribute, um, hit a weapon in there. So, they do that, and so, I'm gonna stop right now. While she's waiting, she's just thinking to herself, like, how am I, how am I gonna, like, do this? How am I gonna win? There's, 23 other tributes that I have to kill. And so she steps on the pad and then the end. I'll tell the rest some other time. Uh, and I'll subscribe, wherever that button is. Add me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, follow me on other stuff, whatever. I'll have the links below. Gotta hope people watch this. Alright, I love you. If you. Have you ever seen like somebody do that? And, like, like, what the heck are you doing? It was like, Alright, so.